online prankster is targeting in and out Burger. And now in and out is fighting back by taking legal action. KCAL 9's Rachel Kim is live in Van Nuys with reaction from customers about this prank. Rachel. Yeah, Elsa and Jeff, in and out says when that prankster walked into this in and out earlier this month and pretended to be their boss, well, it wasn't very funny. In fact, they're now fighting to keep this man away from all their restaurants, and they want him to pay up big time. Hey, I'm your new CEO, Mr. John Trolls. Oh, okay, nice Just doing a little surprise visit. When the man in the dark suit walked into this in and out in Van Nuys and claimed to be their CEO, some believed him, but the manager wasn't convinced. Who are you? Um, I'm actually the new CEO, Mr. John okay, Trollson, so come with me. The man kept insisting he was now the acting CEO and told the workers to make him a cheeseburger and fries for a taste test. The manager's instincts were right. The man is actually Cody Roadster, a self proclaimed online prankster who posts videos on YouTube as troll. Munchies. He posted this video, and you can see he left after employees call police. And the cops are already here. Apparently, Roadster wasn't done with In N Out. The chain said the next day he went to this Burbank restaurant, claimed to be the CEO again, this time demanded to talk to the manager about the contamination of the food. Sir, sir, uh, I hate to say this, hey, but man, I need your food's I'm gonna, I'm gonna take your burger. Sir, I need you to leave now. Yeah, yeah. Sir, this is just, it's, it's garbage. Hey, would you like any fries or drinks with it, sir? In and Out now wants a restraining order against Roadster. They filed a lawsuit against him seeking damages of more than $25,000. In a statement, they said they're not putting up with people coming into their stores trying to promote themselves on social media. Quote, these visitors have unfortunately used deceit, fraud, and trespass to their own advantage, and in each instance, they have attempted to humiliate, offend, or otherwise make our customers or associates uncomfortable. We believe that we must act now. And we will continue to take action in the future to protect our customers and associates from these disruptions. If you're going to do that, there's consequences. And you're doing it on other people's property and you're messing with their brand and their business. It's really, like, disturbing just to get, like, some followers. It's not right. Get a job, get a life, do something, you know? Videos of similar pranks at Ralph's and Taco Bell were also posted. We reached out to Mr. Roaster via email for comment, but we haven't heard back. Back to you in the studio.